As soldiers came home from the war in Iraq, they brought home a piece of life-saving equipment with them. That equipment is the Counter Rocket and Mortar Protection System, or CRAM. D Battery 2nd Battalion 6th Air Defense Artillery was certifying instructors on the system last week on Thompson Hill Range Complex. Staff Sergeant Alberto Marcio requested to become a CRAM operator because he credits the system for saving his life while deployed in 2007. I heard some rounds coming in, which is basically I heard some uh, whistling in the air, explosions on the ground, and at first I woke up out of it, I didn't think anything of it until it got louder and closer. And then I heard the Felix weapon system kick off, I heard the alarms go off, I hit the ground, and I started hearing explosions, but not on the ground anymore, but in the air. So I know that weapon system saved my lives and the fellow soldiers on my particular FOB. 6th ADA has been responsible for training and certifying deploying units on CRAM since 2005, but the military has kept the weapon system highly secretive until now. CRAM uses detection, warning, and interception to keep soldiers and equipment at a forward operating base safe from enemy fire. A command crew monitors the situation using radars and then uses a siren to alert soldiers if artillery, rockets, or mortar are coming in. That sensor and warn piece, that, that siren you're hearing and the alert you hear, is even more vital because you'll notice that that alert goes off and that is the four to five seconds soldiers need to seek cover that will save their lives. The Navy was the first to use CRAM until wartime efforts in Iraq created a need for the heavy duty machinery to make its way to land in 2004. Transported on a truck bed, the land-based phalanx weapon system also ensures there is no collateral damage from the two colliding firepowers. This is taken care of by exploding the enemy's ammo in the air. The side effect of this is an impressive light display. It's like shooting a large bullet with a lot of smaller bullets to knock it out of the air. For Marcio, it's not only about his past experience, but future ones that keep him excited about this technology. It's totally amazing product. And uh, I know for my fellow crew members, they love it, especially every time it fires and it destroys the target. They know when we do this in theater, it'll be saving lives. For the Fort Sill Cannoneer, I'm Marie Barbera.